Kentucky National Guard members are still working in some hospitals to ease the strain on the overwhelmed staff. A lot of what they're doing will never be seen by the general public, but as Phil Pendleton explains, the Guard says they realize how important this mission is. A large warehouse near UK Hospital and Baptist Health holds critical items in the fight against COVID-19. Steps along the supply chain that are behind the scenes. So trucks coming in, trucks going out, things that have to be done in order for the hospital to be fully supplied. Doctors and nurses needed on the front lines. The National Guard was called in to be the hands and feet to fill orders. It feels great. It also feels great when the people in the hospital are very appreciative and I can tell it boosts their morale. The Guard has 30 men and women in Lexington and about 400 in various COVID roles across Kentucky. Necessarily won't see it in the hospital, but it has to get done on the front end so that the hospital has everything that they need so that they can fill the patient's needs. Some Guard members have already finished their assignments in places like Moorhead or Corbin, but a lot still needs to be done in some other places. Second Lieutenant Mann doesn't know when she'll go home to Northern Kentucky, but it doesn't matter. We do not know. That has not been determined yet, but we do know that we will be here as long as there is a need. And as long as we are remaining productive, we are going to stay. They will likely never see a COVID patient. What they're doing is seen as essential to their care. In Lexington, Phil Pendleton, the Fox 56, 10 o'clock news. Some hospitals are seeing guard members and their deployment as the patient load is reducing. One hospital spokesman says the workload is easing, but there's still a big need.